So I bring in all the wishes and greetings from Speed Medical Institute on behalf of all the faculty members to Dr. Suman Yu for scoring rank number 11 in any SS uh, 2022 number session in DM Cardiology Speciality. Congratulations to you. Thank you, sir. Great. So can we know a, a brief background history from where you started until date? Uh, sir, I did my MBBS from uh, IGNCRI Pondicherry. Then I... joined the aims rishikesh and did my md medicine from aims rishikesh in fact it's a honor for me sir because uh, to be sharing with the screen with the teacher like you i have attended your live lectures in person uh, in pondicherry during my pg preparation days it's very nice to have you in the session today and uh, wonderful talking to you as well and uh, jipmer and pondicherry igmr and uh, and mother teresa auditorium and uh, <laughs> all these places we have done classes and uh, i mean yes, yes. Uh, extreme extraordinary and good students like you uh, were there and it's a honor and a pleasure for me as well to talk to you today so after my uh, md medicine i have joined sabdarjan hospital delhi a senior resident in department of medicine and uh, i have worked there till my exams uh, i started preparing for cardiology initially sir i was to be frank i was not decided like whether i have to do uh, dm or not which subject i have to do so before i gave exams in another subjects also uh, before uh, like uh, preparing for cardiology sir in the beginning of march i have started reading cardiology uh, since then uh, after work uh, and duties i will find some time and listen to these speed videos like 6 or 8 videos per day and make notes of these videos and uh, as time passed in the last 2 3 months i have made my preparation uh, to an proper level to a proper level so that i will finish the subject very nice very nice and uh, so the journey from uh, jipmer to aims rishikesh now we are descending towards where is it uh, towards i mean have you made uh, some options i have prepared for srijitra only cardiology excellent so all premier institutes have been there and uh, you are it's, it's fantastic for moving on uh, to places of excellence and uh, and can you share uh, some of your strategies behind your preparation what all you did uh, during the preparation how you read and uh, how many questions you attended can you give a brief uh, aspect on your strategies and preparation and key for success sir as far as cardiology was concerned uh, it is not like the rest of medicine it is entirely different uh, we have to focus more on the intervention which we are not at all exposed during our uh, uh, pg pg days and uh, i have not worked in a cardiology setup also so that part i was facing a lot of difficulties but thanks to speed and uh, the faculties of speed it was very much simplified in the videos like uh, i cannot thank you much more like it was very easy the intervention part uh, rest of the topics i have read from brown bolt and uh, that's how i cracked this exam sir <laughs> yeah i mean uh, there has been brown bolt has been dissected and the cardiology required area i mean has been yeah. over emphasized on uh, on the app and yes. that, uh, so it is i could finish all the brown bolt based uh, lectures but i tried to finish as much <laughs> as i can <laughs> okay. So, how many questions were you able to attend? I attended seventy-eight questions. Okay, very good. Almost close to eighty. And is your primary exam was an ENSS exam or NEET SS? Sir, ENSS only because uh, <laughs> medicine I was not that strong. Okay. So I prepared properly in cardiology only. Excellent, excellent. And so, my medicine preparation was for the NEET only. I haven't read any more uh, medicine for the IME. I focus mainly on the cardiology and. Uh, as the last three days as you mentioned i have revised that notes in the app like ppt yes because so much helpful yes. yeah that will give you a quick uh, review and idea of uh, uh, the subject and quick revision that is very important and there'll be a visual impact because i have been uh, going through this for past 5 years uh, rather than taking a hand written notes the page memory is less than compared to a powerpoint memory and uh, so the images pictures the correlation uh, i think uh, uh, it appreciates that way our brain appreciates that way and people also feel very comfortable also and they are not very stressed and strained the reading pattern itself has changed uh, in last few years that yes, sir, definitely <laughs> it is more like fresher friendly exams now uh, even this cardiology paper it was like less of intervention less of catheter based diagram based questions 
more of like uh, direct straight forward questions so it will be easy for freshers to crack yes. the exam yes 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 like yes. they're fresh out <laughs> and asim sir i should thank asim sir his lectures are very good and uh, his content is very good and uh, the interview based uh, slides he made and recent updates in cardiology that is also very much helpful there were a lot of questions based on recent updates as and cgs directly as well as indirectly so it was very much helpful yeah i mean that's what uh, i mean we strongly believe in that actually so it has to be the update has to be on daily basis uh, there's a reason why we keep on conducting classes even after having loaded with content keep conducting classes so that some changes will be committed in the class students will ask something teacher will uh, try to read something fresh or learn something from the unit and that can be put across a class only those things are asked in the exam which are in the transition 15 to 20% of the questions which are on the transit area which has come recently or which is happening on clinical practice so that is asked so that has been concentrated so what is the message that you want to give to the aspirants of uh, dm cardiology in future um, to uh, grad uh, pg students i would tell ki start early as possible like in the second year of I mean, start reading standard test books make notes as much as you can and uh, for my fellow physicians who are working in hospitals find some time uh, keep it a passion to crack the dm you can never crack dm exams unless you make it your priority you should have that mentality okay i want dm and i will get within this time period of time so you should have that mentality and keep your spare time for dm preparations only and uh, focus on revisions towards the end and maybe you can take leave for at least 2 weeks before the exams <laughs> and revise that is more important sir very nice doctor great joining us in this session I wish you all the best and all the success and sir in this opportunity i want to talk, thank my parents and my please, wife please for bringing the best out of me and uh, my all my faculties in throughout my ug pg and especially my hod madam in ins rishikesh meenakshi dar and my guide dr venkatesh and uh, i want to thong, thank all my juniors subdergen juniors and all the speed faculty members and the shiva mohan raj the technical <laughs> staff also they are really helpful uh, and uh, when all people who watch this video will feel very happy on looking at your <laughs> video and uh, and you will make uh, their day great and uh, it's really nice to remember people and thank people and we wish you all the best and all the success uh, for a great career in cardiology and as a great cardiologist in us you will serve millions of people best wishes to you thank, thank you, you.